The scene I've been waiting for is about to come, and I'm really excited for it. Yes, I'm talking about Amy and Nathan. Finally, episode 6 will give us plenty of scenes of them getting closer, and I don't know about you guys, but I really want to see them building a nice friendship then become a couple. Today we'll focus on the sneak peek clip from episode 6, so if you're ready, let's begin. The opening scene reveals Katie and her dirt bike. She looks like she's mesmerized by this new hobby of hers, but knowing that she bought it by selling the gift from her mother ruins everything. I believe she really messed up and she should find a way to get the locket back, otherwise it will break Lou's heart on so many levels. What do you think? I also feel like she'll be involved in an accident because she actually has no knowledge about a dirt bike. Maybe that's how Lou will find out what she did. Besides, I feel like Tim will be the one who will buy the heart locket back just to fix the relationship between Lulu and Katie. That would be really nice of him to do so. But on the other hand, I believe Katie needs to face the consequences of her actions, and she should learn to be better. Then we see Jack wishing luck to Amy and Blue in the competition. Last time I checked, Amy built a strong bond with Blue, and I feel like together they will be a remarkable competitor. I'm sorry Jack couldn't make it though. He was really hyped and excited about it. Also, when he realized that Nathan is intimidated by Jack and Blue's performance, he felt great and I love seeing him happy. But well, Lisa needs him and she is so much more important than a competition. So I believe he definitely did the right thing. Maybe he can take part in the next one and I would love to watch him in a competition. The next thing we see in the clip is Amy riding her truck and she's probably on her way to Brayburn. But something goes wrong with the truck so she stops. Thankfully, Nathan is right there to help her and he asks if she needs a hand. There's a smirk on his face which I find very adorable and playful. When he talks to Jack, Tim or Lou, he's this innocent, lovely man. But when it comes to Amy, he's really flirty and charismatic and I feel like Amy is nervous when he's around. There's an undeniable attraction and chemistry between them, and I believe we will get to learn more about their future in this episode. They will spend some time together while fixing the truck, and of course they have this competition they will attend. So prepare yourselves for lots of Amy and Nathan scenes. It will be amazing. There's another thing I wanna talk about with you. I constantly read the comments, and I see lots of people saying Amy has to be alone and take care of her child instead of chasing men, and I strongly disagree. Of course, there's nothing wrong with being alone, but if she's ready to move on and if she has feelings for someone, why shouldn't she just try her luck? Is it because Ty is dead or is it because she's a mother? In either case, I believe she needs to follow her heart. If she's ready to move on, we all should be happy instead of being angry just because she wants to be with someone. Grief and loss work differently on people and if Amy will be happy with a partner, then she should be. She doesn't have to feel bad for this, and I'm sure Ty will always be a part of her life. Remember how Lisa remembered all the good times she spent with her deceased husband, even though they had really bad times too. So Amy will never forget Ty, but in the meanwhile, she can love someone else too. Not to mention that Lindy will always be her priority no matter what. Just because she wants love in her life, it doesn't mean that she will abandon Lindy or stop taking care of her. She has always been a good mom, and I believe she keeps doing the best she can. What do you think about Amy and Nathan? Do you think they will be a couple? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, check my other Heartland videos. I bet you'll like them too. Don't forget to like and share this video. You can also subscribe for more Heartland content. It means a lot to me. Thanks for watching. See you soon.